Welcome back. New tonight, a Florida man needed a double lung transplant to beat COVID. Fox 35's Stephanie Buffamonte spoke with him and his wife about how he's doing now and their new message to others. One, two, three. Every time I breathe is a gift. A gift because 50 year old David Wilkinson is breathing air through two new lungs thanks to an organ donor. It's, it's the biggest miracle I can imagine. After getting COVID-19 and ending up on a ventilator five months ago, his wife was given the heartbreaking decision to keep him on life support or not. They said it would take about five minutes for him to pass. But they weren't ready to give up. Before he was placed on life support, you know, he made me promise that I would not let him stop fighting. That's where Dr. Cynthia Grease comes in. She saw a post on Facebook about David and had a mission to make David Admin Health Orlando's first COVID-19 related lung transplant recipient, advising David's wife to keep him on life support. And I said, you know, just hold on. Let's just hold on for a little bit longer. Let's see if he can get better. They flew David to Advent Health Orlando, where they got him well enough to qualify for the double lung transplant in November. After seeing so much death and, and, and lost so much during that time, having something, you know, a story like this come out of out of a Facebook post, I mean, I think that is kind of the, the, the things that kind of help us um, be uplifted. While the road to get him where he is now, learning to walk again and going through therapy has been hard, he didn't give up. Come on. You lose hope, you lose the battle. Mm -hmm. You stop trying, you lose. Encouraging people to become organ donors and make those wishes clear with their families. None of us are guaranteed tomorrow. Right. And, you know, um, your organs can save multiple people's lives or they can just be embalmed with the rest of you. To give others another chance at life like he has. I could never thank them enough for the gift that they've given me. Drive you crazy. Stephanie Buffmonte, Fox 35 News.